I want y'all to take a guess. Guess right now. Drop in the comment section below how many locks I have. Hey crew, welcome to my channel if you're new and welcome back if you're a returning OG. My name is Kiana and today we are going to be counting my locks. So if you guys want to see how many locks your girl has, y'all already know what to do. Stay tuned. Before we get into counting my locks, I just want to give you guys a huge shout out for supporting my channel. If you decided to click on this video and watch your girl, thank you so much. It means the world to me. The crew is growing strong. We are about to hit 7K and I just cannot believe it. And I just want to give you guys a huge, huge, huge virtual hug, okay? Because you know we gotta stay we gotta stay a little bit stay a little bit apart. But I just want to give you guys a huge hug and a ton of kisses because y'all mean the world to me. Y'all literally motivate me every single day to sit in front of a camera and create content. Like, if it was not for y'all, I don't think I would really be doing this, but it's the motivation and it's the support for me. So I just want to give you guys a huge thank you and 10K, we on the way, okay? Period. And then next is 100K and then, you know, and then, you know, they're on, okay? But <laughs> y'all are here to see how many locks your girl has in her head. So, if you're new to my channel, y'all don't know, but your girl just started her lock journey. So, I started my locks on July 1st, and I actually did them myself. I did the two-strand twist method to, you know, be my starter, to be my base for my journey. And, um, yeah, today is September 5th, so I am two months in, and I am feeling good. I really, really love how my hair looks. I actually did my second retwist last night and I actually have a retwist. Um, I have a video on my channel of how I did my first retwist so I literally did the same exact thing in that video. So if you guys want to see how I did that I will link it up above in the cards. I don't know which side of the screen it is but it will be up in the cards and I'll also put it down in the description box. But yeah, did my second retwist last night and my second retwist it went it wasn't as smooth as the first one. The first retwist was like a freaking breeze. Like I literally finished everything in like three hours. The second time, I don't know what was going on. I don't know if it was because I was tired because I filmed yesterday or it was just, I don't know if it was late, but it took me three hours to retwist then plus the drying time. And the dryer that I was using yesterday, it like fell apart. So I wasn't able to sit under the dryer. So I had to have these clips in my head like the rest of the night. Y'all, it was a process, but we here, we made it, okay, and I love, 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 love my hair, my husband loves my hair, and I'm just, ah, I'm so happy with my growth, and I really can't wait until my locks mature, like, baby, when they mature, I'm gonna be a baddie, okay, um, so one more thing before we get into counting my locks, you guys, I need you guys' opinion, I need y'all help, okay, so, I've been itching, like literally itching, okay, to color my hair. What do you guys think I should do? Should I leave it black? Should I leave it in its natural state? I've never colored my hair ever. Anytime I've had colored hair, it was weave, it was like extensions, it was like a wig or something like that. So I've seen myself with color, so I, you know, baby girl look good, okay, and that's a period. So I know that I'll look good with color, but for my locks, I really want to color my hair, but... I, like I kind of know what colors I want, but I don't know what color I want. So let me tell y'all my options, okay? And I want you guys to drop them down in the comments below if I should color it and which color. So I'll, I'll put pictures on the screen so you guys can have a reference of what I'm going for. So I was thinking about doing like an auburn ginger type color because I really love how that color looks on my skin. Like baby, I look so good when I do that color, okay? And then the second color option I was thinking was to do a burgundy, like a 99J, like a dark deep red. So I don't know which color I want to do just yet, but whatever color I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to bleach my hair. So that's the part that I'm scared about because my locks aren't that mature yet. So, you know, I don't want to do anything to mess up the locking process right now. But like, I really, 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 really want to color my hair. So y'all tell me what I should do. Should I, or should I just wait and be patient? But let me know which color y'all think I should do because I really do want to color my hair like it's going to happen. And worst case scenario, if I don't like the color, literally I could just put black hair color back over my hair and just go back to black. So yeah, let me know what y'all think I should do. 
in the comments below, okay? I would really appreciate you guys' opinion. I would really appreciate you guys' thoughts. So, let's get into what y'all came here for. So, um, as I said before, I did my retwist last night. So, my hair looks a little something like this. I should have took a before picture of what my hair looks like when it's like super duper, super duper grown out. Baby, I look crazy, I look homeless, and I just look a hot mess when my new girl comes in. So last night, I just had to go in and twist it. Um, I'll post a picture of what my first, what my hair looked like before I retwisted the first time. So if you're new, you guys can get an idea of <laughs> how baby girl was looking. twisted now as you guys can see the roots are you know all twisted up so it is starting the process of actually you know locking up and uh when i wear my hair out it's typically like this or i do a little cute side little moment or whatever because that just that's just what looks nice um so i am going to actually put my hair Part it down the middle, so I don't actually have like a middle, middle part. My parts is kind of a little bit jagged, cricket, but it's okay. I'm going to part my hair down the middle, and we're just going to count one side, and then we'll do the other side. Okay, so this is what my hair look like right now, y'all. So I did my locks on the smaller, medium side because I want the smaller, medium look. But recently, I kind of been thinking, um, sorry, I'm trying to pull up my calculator. So after I'm done counting, we could, uh, <laughs> we can do this because baby math is not my strong suit. Not at all. Not at all. So, um, hold on. Okay. So my, my locks, I did them on the smaller medium size because I want them to be smaller medium, but I kind of been wanting to do them a little bit bigger and I'm still at that stage where I can combine them to make it one but honestly I don't think I'm going to because I kind of really really like the size that I have but um yeah so if you guys wanted to know the size of my um my locks I did go with like the standard brick lay pattern so like around my head the like parting is really neat but it's just like when I get right here I was tired and I was just like, you know what? I want these twists to be done. So that's why the middle is a little janky compared to <laughs> over here where it's super straight and perfect and stuff. But it's okay. It gives my hair some, you know, flavor, some uniqueness and all that good stuff. Hey, babe. Okay, but okay, I know y'all ready for me to count these locks, so let's get straight into it. I'm gonna count and then kind of speed this up so we're not sitting here all day. Dang, I don't know how to do this. Hmm, maybe it'll be easier if I don't have nothing in my hand and then I count. Like when I put them in, yeah, okay, we're gonna do it that way. Okay, here we go. Drop your guess down below. Oh. <sighs> That's a lot. That's a lot. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Okay, so 70 over here. And let's get started.
afro was ugly. But I have 139 locks in my hair. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't believe it. That's a lot. That's low-key a lot. No wonder why I was tired retwisting this shit. God damn it. <laughs> but I am really happy with my lock girls and I can't wait to post more fun videos on this channel of my lock journey i think my next upload i want to post is like you know doing like fun little pinterest short lock styles maybe if you guys want to see that video <laughs> give this video a thumbs up thank you guys so much for tuning in and congratulations in advance to whoever guessed 139 um locks so yes y'all i'll catch you guys in my next video as always be kind and be thankful Mwah. see you next time